Good morning everyone, uh, time for another session of Dark Souls 3 PvP. I literally just woke up, so <laughs> let's see what what's going to happen on this session. Uh, my eyes are yet to open. <laughs> um, yeah, um, today's weapon is going to be the Corvian Great Scythe. A really odd weapon. I've had um, quite a bit of, well, a couple of sessions of practice with this thing. And at first I, I really couldn't do anything with it. <laughs> like, it was so odd to use. And uh, a weird thing about this weapon that kind of comes as a bonus is every single living soul wants to parry it because it has those very lenient, very uh, very comfortable parrying windows and so and everyone knows that. So you really need to play around people trying to parry this thing all the fucking time. But uh, uh, apart from that, uh, some other oddities are the two-handed moveset isn't that great. Why the fuck is the running attack vertical, not horizontal? It's beyond me. But that's why I like the the one-handed moveset better. Uh, I know it's uh, not maybe aesthetically so pleasing that you are using a shield with sides, but I think I crafted a look that makes it kind of work. Um, with this shield, I am able to use. The weapon art, the next wipe, and also the one-handed moveset, which is I prefer to the two-handed one. Uh, some of the attacks of the weapon, mm, let's talk about them a little bit before we start. Uh, running attack, R1, one-handed, is this large horizontal swipe. Once again, very, very easy to parry, but uh, otherwise a pretty decent attack. Not the fastest one, but covers a great range. R2, good for mixing up uh, some of your attacks. Uh, this is one of those weapons that I think is a little bit better for the defensive play. So this kind of catches rolls, rollins, and backstab attempts. So uh, I think it also combos to R1. At least it combos uh, often. <laughs> uh, with the 200 moveset also, uh, I think the R2, R1 is a combo and R1 to R2 is a combo, so that's pretty special. Next wipe at first, um, I used it very wrong. This thing, well it does have a great range, but the hitbox is very odd. It has this kind of tilted hitbox which misses your opponents very often. So, what I started to use it for is the tank hits from very close range to deal some damage. Um, because it has a great hyper armor um, in it. You can really tank some ultra great sword hits with the, at least uh, with the armor set that I have on. I don't know if it um, demands this much armor for you to be able to do that, but well, <laughs> this is the look I'm going for with. So. And also, um, next wipe to R1, one-handed. Usually combos, usually. It's not a true combo, but um, it tends to combo on most, <laughs> most situations. Build is exactly the same as in the last three videos. For my rings, I have the Havel's Ring, Pontius Right Eye, Color and T plus 3, and Lifeling, uh, Lifeling, Life Ring plus 3 that I will be swapping to Sun Princess and some other rings. So, yeah, let's see if we can get anything done. Uh, the thing with this weapon is that every other session goes great, and every other session, as you can see there, my medal is actually silver. Uh, Every other session I just get bullied and parried and fucking outplayed when I use this weapon, so let's see, let's see how it goes this time. Definitely not the easiest weapon to use in the game. 
And we get a quite the challenge here, right from the bat. Crossbows and curved swords and the whole nine. So let's see. Another true combo. <laughs> a little bit of paddy rolling in there. I don't feel bad finishing the fight against that second chance spell with a throwing knife. I could have rolled in him as well, but... Kind of a messy fight, but uh, at least I was able to demonstrate how bravely you can go and trade with uh, weapon art with this one. You really have a disgusting amount of hyper armor while doing it, and yeah, it deals a uh, pretty, pretty decent damage. Uh, and excuse me if you are hearing the neighbor's dog; uh, he or she is having a a bad day or something. Very loud today. Right. Lord. Lord have mercy. Oh yeah. You never expect the eighth R1, that's for sure. Yeah, there goes the Paris. <laughs> GG. You are going to see a lot of people try the Paris weapon if you use it. <laughs> that I can guarantee. The nasty thing is, they somewhat get it. But yeah, I definitely would recommend using the, the next wipe as close uh, to your opponent as possible, even though the the animation of the attack or the great hitbox it has uh, would uh, suggest otherwise maybe, but uh, yeah, weep souls. Whoa, nice, okay, okay, nice one. That range totally caught me off guard.
But yeah, um, this weapon doesn't really have a great damage. It's not like the worst, but you would expect something better from a huge weapon like this. 420 with 50 dexterity isn't all that great. But as, as I said, not the worst either. Hello there. Ah! Stop it. If this guy isn't trying to parry me, I will eat my fucking ass. So nothing out of the usual. What? He got hit, but he didn't get damaged. That is quite weird. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Gunky guy. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> it's the slowest creep to the backstab I tried in there. <laughs> oh, I'm such a fuck up. <laughs> no fucking way, man. No fucking way with this fucking Paris. <laughs> Don't you fucking try. No, no. No, no. Let's try it. No. <laughs> Hit this match. Oh my god. Oh, GG. <laughs> I don't know, that match was somehow weird. When you get these guys that like try to parry this weapon no matter what, it's, it always is. Kind of funny. But yeah, I should probably turn on the, def <laughs> the defense play a little bit more when playing with this weapon, but it's my aggressive soul that takes over. I always need to be the first one to go in and fuck myself up. Okay, are we going to get a rematch maybe? No, it's some other guy. Crossbow. Never glad to see that. <laughs> oh, nice! There we go. Nice gesture of him to pick the same weapon. A 
I know it looks perverted as fuck to use the weapon art two times in a row, but that's something that people do not expect. <laughs> it's like the 8th R1, you never expect it. bounce off, that's good. into the shield now that's pretty convenient oh no <laughs> that was kind of a clunky fight wasn't it <laughs> but as you can see there I could actually poise through the hit with the next swipe in there even though it was an ultra great sword so Recovery uh, of it was a little bit too slow, so I got champed in there. But yeah, sometimes I be feel a little bit armless when I'm playing with this weapon, but let's try to do our best. Shield is out. I wish that would roll catch more. The arts, uh, it does sometimes, but usually doesn't. What the? No! Oh, did he not get hit in there? What the fuck? <laughs> oh! No. Fuck! Not cool. Not cool at all. Oh my goodness. You could hear the spaghetti fucking running out of my pockets. God damn it. This weapon has the weirdest moments, I, I swear to you. Some things that should hit just don't register at all. <laughs> God. might have looked wonky, but that is actually the wake up I have gotten most out of with this weapon. Kick the weapon out. Shenanigans. Thank you. 
good. Finish this knife, it's cheesy. Whoa. I noticed that I haven't been locking off with this session too much, which is odd but because I do that very often with this weapon when I play, usually, but I don't know why I don't do it now. Sorry, a little burp there, disgusting. My brain's a mush on the mornings. I do whatever. Don't mind me. But yeah, I will be doing these little PvP sessions now as often as I can. Uh, sometimes there will be uh, many days and I cannot do one. I'm extremely busy these days, so pardon me, but um, I try to do this as much as I can. I also plan on doing a session or sessions for Risk of Rain 2, which is my game of the year of last year. So, um, I couldn't live with myself if I won't do any videos about that game because that game is fucking fantastic. What? What? How did? How? How did that happen? Why am I getting destroyed by spam today so much? so fucking bad today, holy shit. <laughs> I'm sorry guys. Let's show you the strengths of this weapon, get fucked all the time. <laughs> oh my god, this is the worst session ever. Well, I think it's a... Uh, it could be entertaining, <laughs> at least. Souls get so fucked up. Oh, that was a weird shit. Oh, we have a load of latency, so let's see how this goes. What? What? What the fuck? Oh no, I. No! <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no! <laughs> fucking day, man. Fucking save my life. Oh, God. Wow. 
I was in the goddamn menu getting fucked left and right in there. I really need a new controller, this is just... Ah, fuck me. Oh shit, this session is like fucking dumpster fire. Uh, well, at least I'm having fun morning here. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, this guy is blue. Oh, mages are not my favorite thing to fight with this shit. The running attack is just slow enough for me not to get anything done usually. Let's see. Just and just. Close. We're getting close, but we sure aren't getting those wins today. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Guy of Astora. Okay, guy. Let's see. He hit me once, look at my health bar. Jesus Christ. Mm, let's take like three more matches. <laughs> Not the smoothest session here. I know, but um, yeah, I tend to have a lot of weird sessions with this weapon. Uh, it is it is quite odd to use. You sometimes have these very cool matches with it, but it, it doesn't seem to be the day that I have them. <laughs> it doesn't seem to be the day. <laughs> All right, that buff is going off.
Crow Talents, why? Is it trying to parry me? Uh oh, what the hell? My, my controller! No, no! Don't disconnect now! What the hell? This session is cursed. <laughs> this fucking session is cursed, guys. <laughs> I fucking <laughs> now my controller is disconnecting. Oh fuck! Okay, a spear. Interesting. Hey, I fought this guy earlier, didn't I? I think I did. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> Jesus! Fuck! Damn it. Well, luckily there's only one fight left. <laughs> I can't play with this disconnecting controller. <laughs> luckily I didn't get punished for it too much. <laughs> what? what a session. Well, I, actually it wakes me up pretty good, so... Could be worse. Okay, time for the last fight of the day, ladies and gentlemen. And everything in between. This has been quite the... Quite a thrill ride. <laughs> oh no. Alex the Reaper. Damn it, his hyper armor was able to finish it off. Nicely played in there, to be honest. <clears throat> Already losing my voice in the airport. <laughs> After laughing. Uh, well, pretty anticlimactic. Uh, anticlimatic. Last fight, but yeah. This was a shit show of a session, but hey, I think it's uh, it's worth of sometimes uploading sessions where I don't just fucking own everybody, or at least most of the people, so... Uh, it's a good balance, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, Corbin Great Knife... Uh, no, not Great Knife, uh, Great Scythe. Uh, you can do more with it than I was actually displaying here. These were, like, unusually bad matches. So, maybe we will do another session with this one day, but... At least you saw some of the action with it. <laughs> yeah, holy shit. I really played bad today, but... Well, that's just life. Thank you so much for watching, everyone, and... Take care.